Thank you for tuning in to IoT Connect, where we're covering some of the most interesting topics, trends, and news around the Internet of Things. IoT Connect is brought to you by Teal, a wholly owned, patented, GSMA certified eSIM platform that helps to connect any IoT device to any network globally. Today, our episode is being recorded in Las Vegas. We're right in the middle of MWC Mobile World Congress, and I'm really excited to be welcoming Rob Gaskin from Three Group Solutions to the show. Rob, welcome. Thank you very much. That's great to be here. Well, Rob, I thought we'd just kick it off and maybe you can give a, a quick introduction to uh, your role at Three Group Solutions and maybe just a high level overview for those of us Americans that maybe aren't as familiar with Three. Yeah, sure. Thanks, Rob. So uh, my name is Rob Gaskin. I work for, as you say, Three Group Solutions and uh, I'm predominantly working in the wholesale side of Three Group Solutions. And to give you a bit of background about what Three Group Solutions do, we package um, global network assets. Uh, so we have 11 wholly owned mobile networks across the globe, in Europe and in Asia. And this enables us to provide services out to key industries um, with the use of uh, wholesale services. Uh, we have IoT applications that we can support private networks. So we supply um, a bunch of those services across a number of different industries. Um, so it might be it might be a travel sim, it might be an IT provider like yourself. Yep. It might be an airport, it might be a port that's mm -hmm. looking for super 5G strong connectivity. Um, so we're here predominantly today, obviously to celebrate our platform um, collaboration together uh, and to um, yeah have a chat more about what else is going on. You know that's a really good transition, Rob, because just yesterday. Teal announced our partnership with Three to accelerate the adoption of eSIM, especially within Europe. And you know, I know that you just mentioned that you have 11 different networks, almost 200 million customers worldwide. But in your opinion, you know, why should our customers be excited about this partnership? Well, because obviously, because of those wholly owned networks, and because we also have sort of 400 um, tier one uh, carrier footprint, mm -hmm. sort of distribution, um, it means that we can offer the very much the best in class connectivity and reliability yeah. for your customers. So your customer is going to get um, the benefit of, of all of those um, you know, key partners that we work with. Obviously, for you, the important thing is the connectivity and the reliability that we can give to you. Yeah. That your customers are going to see and have trust in and have confidence in. Absolutely, 100%. Well, we're, we're really excited about that partnership. If you haven't checked it out, check out the announcement on the teal.io website. Uh, but getting in back to MWC, you've obviously traveled across the pond from London to be here in Las Vegas. What are some of the things that you're going to be talking about this week at MWC? I think we're predominantly looking to talk to US-based um, companies. Maybe it's an MBO, maybe it's an IoT provider, maybe it's a, um, a, a, a business here that's looking to extend their roaming footprint, mm -hmm. um, maybe looking towards travel sim, something like that, where they can talk to us and you know, we can help them establish uh, a, a footprint outside of the US, whether it be uh, in Europe, obviously we cover the globe, mm -hmm. um, but I know we're predominantly we're talking to you guys about uh, Europe, but if there is companies in the US that are interested in starting to establish themselves in, in, in Europe, uh, outside of the US, then uh, they should come and talk to us. Absolutely. Uh, you know, we're, we're at the second day of the show. Yesterday, I, I know you probably had a chance to walk the, the show floor. What are some of the technologies or some of the innovative companies that get you excited? I think, I think for us, what's really interesting is the satellites or direct to sell mobile space. Uh, we think there is, uh, it's really interesting. Um, there's clearly activity, activity that's going on there, a number of partnerships being announced with yeah. MNOs across the globe. The numbers are still small, but uh, the use cases are pretty, pretty defined. You know, we have emergency calling, SMS, yeah. and um, voice maybe a bit further down the line. Yeah, I mean, I, I know Global Star is, is out here, and they've got a really cool SOS product that I took a look at. Uh, I think all of us have probably heard about the T-Mobile and Starlink partnership. And I think there's just going to be more to come, right? I mean, but but in reality, how far out do you think we are from actually seeing direct to sell being a being a? Being uh, a I think thing? it's I think in terms of global sort of more of a scalable 
service. I think it's still early days. Yeah. But like I said, we're, we're, we're looking at the space. It's interesting. Mm -hmm. um, there's certainly a lot of interest there. And we'll be sure to obviously keep you guys and, and everybody updated about what we, what we do with that, that particular service in the future. Indeed. Yeah, that's great. Well, so outside of, of satellite, direct to sell, what are some other topics, themes, things that, that you're looking to learn a little bit more about this week? I'm looking to learn a bit more about where the, sort of the travel sim space okay. is. So it's, it's growing. Uh, the U.S. is one of the big areas for travel sim adoption. Mm -hmm. So uh, for us, this is very much um, an area of expertise for us. We have a, a cloud-based MBNO, um, MBNE, sorry, um, aggregator platform, mm -hmm. which we can talk to MVNOs, maybe they're here offering a domestic offering, uh, and then they want to be able to then offer an international offering with a travel sim yeah. under their same brand. Uh, because we're cloud-based, it's very very much API-driven, we can get uh, an MVO up and running pretty much within sort of six to eight weeks. So that's actually incredible. So maybe we can we can touch on that. So maybe you can put that, that time frame in context, because six to eight weeks really isn't a long time. That's pretty rapid. No. No, it's not. And I guess I guess some of the things that can happen in six to eight weeks, you can break your uh, break your arm or break your elbow, and it will yeah. mend within six to eight mm -hmm. weeks. I think in the US, you can get trialed and 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 punished and put down for murder in six <laughs> to eight weeks as well. So it's it's pretty quick. Um, long gone were the days of you know MBNOs having to spend twelve months and a million dollars talking to an MNO about getting set up. Um, this is a far more slick, more fluid process now. So um, MBNO, existing MBNOs yeah. maybe here shouldn't think that this is a long process. This is a, a fairly quick, fluid process. And we've, we've kind of, we've refined how we work with, with uh, MBNO partners over time. And it, it's proving really, really good for our partners and for us. Yeah, and I, I can speak to that as well. For us at Teal, I think by the time we said yes, please, it was probably within that six week time frame that That's we right. were up and running. And, you know, we, like I said, we just made an announcement yesterday. So. Kudos to you guys because you really streamlined everything, and it's it's sort of um, it's it's a little bit of a different experience than you might might expect from an MNO. Yeah. Yeah, and then you know, so like we say, Rob, we're really looking forward to working with you, really helping to support you as as you sort of expand your footprint into Europe, using our global connectivity, and uh, we think we're going to do a lot of business with you. So we're really really proud and uh, you know very supportive. Well, fantastic. Well, Rob, if people are looking to learn a little bit more about Three Group Solutions, where can they find you? Well, they can find me on LinkedIn. Yep. Uh, we obviously we're, we're active on there. We're we're, we're sort of regularly posting uh, announcements uh, across our LinkedIn pages. Um, uh, you can contact us via our website. So there is an email address, mm -hmm. dedicated email address that can, that, can, that, uh, that prospects and customers can come through and, and talk to us, mm -hmm. uh, and we'll they'll get fed through to the wholesale team myself and another colleague uh which is probably the best way of doing it yep um so i would uh, welcome anybody who would like to talk to us about uh what we do fantastic well at teal we're super excited about our partnership with three if you're passionate about iot and you want to tune into future episodes of iot connect be sure to click that like and subscribe button and for those that want to learn a little bit more about Teal and our mission critical, critical connectivity platform, head on over to teal.io. We look forward to uh, future episodes of the IoT Connect podcast. Thanks.